Hi everyone, well, welcome to video one of my Fallout New Vegas playthrough. All right, if you're new to my channel, I have been playing Fallout 4. So I guess like regarding this game, I am familiar with like the world and like the universe this game is set in. Um, so I am familiar also with like the lore and everything. But as for this game itself, I don't know what to expect. I don't really know like what it's about or like the theme or the quest or anything. So I guess I'm like going into this game blind, but like with context, I guess, if that makes sense. Anyways, this game has been highly like suggested on my channel. Uh, so I'm really excited to get right into it and start playing. All right, let's see. So we'll go... Oh, wrong one. Oops. New game. There we go. <laughs> uh, start a new game. This will overwrite your autosave if present. That's okay. <laughs> okay. Las Vegas, Atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. Oh, As decades yeah, okay. passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its like army Hoover and Dam. sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam just barely against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. If 
but I ain't a fink. Dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. Oh shit. Okay. Okay, so we have the Legion versus the, Re the Republic? No, what were they called? Okay, anyways, there's two factions that are like at battle with each other, and I'm a courier, and I need to go to the Las Vegas Strip to deliver a package. Okay. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a sec? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? There we go. My name is Krista. can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. <laughs> okay. Doc Mitchell. Well, Doc Mitchell? Good Springs. Now, good Springs. I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? Oh, boy. Oh, this character creation. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh, too far. All right, guys. Give me a minute. I might do this part off camera. <laughs> um... Okay. Randomize. Randomize your head. Yes. Customize. Okay. 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 Oh, okay. Maybe I'll go back and randomize to something that looks better and then I can build from there. Okay. I'm going to do this off camera. I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, guys, welcome back. So this is my character. She took me like 45 minutes to build. This freaking character creation was so brutal. Oh my gosh. I hate everything. Anyways, this is what I came up with. I don't know. She has kind of like really light pink, blonde, white, whatever hair. Her eyes are green, but you can't really tell. They all look the same to me. But yeah, this is what she looks like. So let's go. We're going to say done. Are you sure you want this to be your character? I guess. Well, I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay, no sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Please. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Okay. Ooh, I'm gonna have to change the color of that. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm really sad also in the character creation, I couldn't give my character a scar on her eye. All of the characters I've created so far have had like a scar on one of their eyes. And I'm sad I couldn't be consistent with that, but that's okay. All right, let's just like see, what do we have over here? Should I be taking junk like I do? What did that say? Take off Flathmosco. Oh, I cannot read. What do we also have here? Med X, okay. A blood pack. Okay, I'm familiar with that. Take paperweight. Okay, we got a terminal. We have a chemistry set. We have clipboard. Finance clipboard. Okay. 
cool. Okay, I guess I should just finish this friggin' tutorial and walk over here. We're looking good so far. Go ahead Thank and you. give the bigger tester a try. All right, activate. You'll learn right quick if you get back all your faculties. Okay, perfect. Yes. Okay, okay. Um. Okay, let's see. Strength will tell you how easily a cowboy totes his saddle and those bigger firearms, or how much he's gonna be for you in a saloon brawl. Okay. Let's see. So this affects your melee, unarmed, my inventory weight, which is important, uh, damage, and weapon effectiveness. Okay, and I have a total of. Uh, lightweight. No, lightweight. Okay, perception. Um, let's see. The explosives, blah, blah. explosives, lockpick, energy, weapons, accuracy, compass range. Oh, interesting. The perceptive cowboy always knows when there's a lit stick of dynamite nearby or when a varmints sneak it up on him okay i'm trying to think okay my character's backstory let's build this to her strengths okay so right now she's a courier i feel like she's gonna need to be like pretty perceptive not necessarily strong ah uh, endurance you can't keep a good cowboy down if he's the enduring type and not if he's gonna oh my god i can't read not if he's got a six shooter the size of all tarnation okay unarmed health resistance survival Okay. Charisma. Uh, speech, barter, companion, nerve. Intelligence. Uh, a smart cowboy is good at most anything from sucking the poison out of your rattle or bite to fixing your broken wig and axle. Science, repair, medicine, skill points. Yeah, I like charisma. Um, I like endurance. I feel like sh I don't know. Agility. Luck. Oh shit, there's so many of these. <laughs> okay, luck. Uh, all skills, critical hits, enemy mishaps. Uh, let's see. Agility, guns, sneak, speed, action point, regeneration. Uh, uh, I think I like her having high endurance. But maybe like bad luck. <laughs> we'll say she's really unlucky. But she doesn't need luck because she's bulletproof. Yeah, I think I'm okay with this. Okay, let's review. Okay, so strength is four, perception is seven, endurance is nine, charisma seven, intelligence six, agility six, and luck is one. Yeah, I think I'm okay with that. Wait, what does this do? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm happy. How do I get out of here now? Right, okay. Is my face in the way of, like, a command prompt? No. Um, okay. Yeah, I'm sad. Okay, how do I get out of this, though? Uh, right, I'm happy with my choices.
Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now that don't make a lick of sense. Seems to me you're the luckiest son of a gun in New Vegas. What? Well, we know your vitals are good. But that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a big one and drop. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through <laughs> a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. That's actually kind of funny. I gave, like, my person, like, she's the least likely to, or, like, she's so unlucky, but she literally got lucky because she survived a bullet wound or, like, a gunshot to the head or whatever. Sit down on the couch. Alrighty. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Grab an object right. to look at it. I'm gonna say a word. I want you okay. to say the first thing that comes to Ooh, mind. Ooh, okay, okay. Dog. Cat. <laughs> House. Mouse. Oh. Uh, shelter, I guess. Oh, wait, is this choosing a... Uh, is the mouse an option? Okay. Um, a house is an investment. That's actually not. A house is shelter. That's too obvious, though. Uh, burglarize. Night. Day. Oh. Uh, campfire, dream, shroud, sleep, treasure, silencer. What? For night? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Night. Uh, silencer. Bandit. Stab. Uh, stab. Light. Dark. Light is dark. I don't know. Mother. Father. <laughs> Cookie jar. Regret. A human shield? We'll say regret. Okay. Now I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. Okay. First one. Conflict just ain't in my nature. I disagree. I ain't given to relying on others for support. Is this going to affect my relationship with companions? Disagree. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. Is this character? Fuck yeah, she is. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. What? No, I disagree. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Uh... Uh, agree. Almost done here. Huh. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Um, okay, just wait. I want to see. I don't I have no idea. What do I see without actually looking at the screen? I see like. I have no idea what the fuck. Okay, a broken chain, a chemical reaction. A shadow in a door frame. Yeah, actually, too angry headed, an angry two headed ant. How do you see that? Yeah, I see a shadow in a door frame. Okay. How about this one? That's like a person with like a long shadow and then darkness coming out of the shadow. Um. I'm too embarrassed to say what it looks like. <laughs> Last one. That too. <laughs> um, okay, so that one I see dark like mountains and then a waterfall going into like a little like kind of like pond area and then it's flowing kind of out of another waterfall. A light in the darkness, a mushroom cloud. Uh, a head on a pillow. Okay, none of these are like what I see. <laughs> uh, I guess I do kind of see a mushroom cloud. I see more waterfalls than that. A bearded man. How do you see a bearded man? 
Oh, I guess. I also see a light in the darkness. I don't know. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right to you. All right. Tell me about myself. My skills. Okay. My bartering skill is 17. The barter skill affects the prices you get for buying and selling items. In general, the higher your barter skill, the lower your prices. All right. Energy weapons are 32. Explosives are... Do you know what? Let's see. Explosive skill determines the ease of disarming any hostile mines and the effectiveness of explosive weapon. All mines, all grenades, missile launcher, fat mat. Oh, no. No, I want to reset this one. Okay. Ah, okay. Guns. Yeah, we want a good gun skill. Medicine, melee weapons, repair, science, speech, survival, unarmed. The unarmed skill is used for fighting without a weapon or with weapons designed for hand-to-hand -hand combat. No. Oh, that's a base one? Oh, I see. Okay. What do I want to add to? We're just going to do this. Um, let's add to... Um, the speech dialogue governs how much you can influence someone through dialogue and gain access to information. Yeah, I like that for sure. Repair. Maintain any weapons and apparel in addition. Yes. And energy weapons. Oh, wait, but I wanted barter. Maybe repair. Well, I could probably build that up. I think at the beginning of the game, I think bartering, energy weapons, and speech are probably the best for, like, beginning of the game. And then I'm sure as I, like, once I look at the skill tree and get skills, I could probably build up, like, the repair one. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with this. Done. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. Okay. I got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history. Oh Just a okay. formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Um, okay. Choose up to two traits or none. Okay, let's see. Build to destroy. The flamer that burns twice as bright burns half as long. All weapons have plus three chance to critically hit, but equipment condition decays 15. No, that sounds shitty. Uh, fast shot. While using guns and energy weapons, you fire 20% more quickly, but your shots are 20% less accurate. That might really handicap me because I'm already shitty at shooting. Um, four eyes. While wearing any type of glasses, you have a one plus perception. Without glasses, you have a minus one. Yeah, my character will be wearing glasses. Maybe. What if I hate the way the glasses look and then I'm stuck always having like less perception? I don't know. Uh, let's see. Okay, good natured. You're good natured at heart, more prone to solving problems with your mind than violence. You gain plus five to barter, medicine, repair, science, and speech, but have minus five to energy weapons. No. Heavy handed. You're merely an unarmed attacks do more damage, but less critical hit damage. Kamikaze. You have plus ten action points, but your reckless nature causes you to have a minus two damage threshold. Threshold. Maybe. Uh, from fray grenades to throwing spears, you can throw weapons 30% faster at a cost of 25% less range. Uh, due to your small size, you have a plus one agility, but your limbs are more easily crippled. <laughs> uh, trigger discipline. While using guns and energy weapons, you fire 20% more slowly, but are 20% more accurate. I feel like this one is like the opposite of fast shot. <laughs> While using guns and energy weapons, you fire 20% more quickly, but 20% less accurate. And then this one here, you, while using, you fire 20% more slowly, but are 20% more accurate. So this one, the 20% of less and more cancels out. So then, yeah, no, that'd be stupid, because then you just fire slowly. So that's if you want to build up, like, the fast shot. No, wait, those two do cancel each other out. Fast shot and fucking trigger discipline are literally, they can't laugh, so stupid. I can choose those two and then just like, I'm the same. 
Okay, uh, Wild Wasteland. Wild Wasteland unleashes the most bizarre and silly elements of post-apocalyptic America. Not for the faint of heart. Oh, I want that one. Yes, give me random things. Yes, okay. So my person needs glasses and... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wild Wasteland unleashes the most bizarre and silly elements of post-apocalyptic America. Not for the faint of heart. Uh, or this, or the serious of temperament. Yeah, I like that. Um, okay, I think. Uh. Yeah, I'm happy with this. All right, I guess that about does it. Come with me, I'll see you out. Can I change my clothing? Can I? Let's see. Ah, oh, okay. Are you gonna give me some clothing? I'm assuming I didn't show up here wearing this. Here, these are yours. Was all you had on you when you was brought in. I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin, but it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. <laughs> they call it a pip boy. I grew up in one of them vaults they made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much used to be Before now, but the you war. might want okay. such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on too, so the locals About don't pick on you for lack and modesty. It was my wife's. Aww. I think she was about your size, and she hardly wore it after we left the vault. Felt it was too brazen. Um. What do I? No, wait. Thanks for patching me up. Uh, don't mention it. It's what I'm here for. <clears throat> you should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll likely be at the saloon. Okay. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. Wait, I was killed? Whoa, what's this hardcore mode? No, no, no. Uh, hardcore mode. Fallout New Vegas allows you to play in a new hardcore mode that greatly increases the challenge of the game. In this mode, stim packs heal over time and cannot mend broken limbs. Rattle away removes radiation over time. Ammunition has a weight and dehydration is a constant concern. This mode is only recommended for advanced players. That is not me. <laughs> You may turn hardcore mode on or off at any time and get the gameplay menu, but if you activate hardcore mode now and maintain it through the end of the main storyline, you'll receive a special reward. Would you like to activate hardcore mode? No, and <laughs> that's recommended. <laughs> oh, I got an achievement. Alright, what can I... Okay. Should I be looting things? Okay, let's take a look at... I don't think this is supposed to happen. All right, guys, that was really annoying. I literally had to restart the game. <laughs> um, the game auto-saved, though, at one point, so I didn't have to, like, rebuild my character, thankfully. Oh, I'm gonna be scared to push that button now. Okay, let's take a look at this. C and D. Right. Okay. Okay, so I have a laser pistol that is equipped. Okay, it's equipped now. Apparel. No, that's a radio. Weapons. What? Wait, what? Ah. Apparel can consist of many different types of gear, ranging from clothing and armor to sunglasses and hats. 
DT, sum of parallel grants damage threshold to the wearer. Your DT is the sum of all DT for currently equipped apparel plus any bonuses from perks or chems. DT is directly subtracted from incoming damage, so a higher DT provides superior protection. Though a small percentage of damage can get through even the thickest armor, a high DT is quite valuable. C and D, apparel's condition. C and D affects how much protection it provides. Apparel above 50% C&D provides maximum protection and only needs to be maintained. Light, medium, heavy. Medium and heavy apparel will slow characters down when equipped. Repair. This option opens the repair submenu, which allows apparel to be repaired by salvaging parts from similar items. Okay. Ammunition is used by almost all guns and energy weapons, but is sometimes used for other weapon types. Basic ammo types have no special effects, but ammo subtypes may increase damage, reduce an enemy's damage threshold, or even decrease sp spread. Okay. Uh, effects are listed on the ammo submenu. When the ammo is highlighted, most weapons can use any ammo subtype that starts with the same. Well, it starts with the same name as the base ammo. Common ammo subtypes include armor piercing ignores. A large portion of the enemy's damage threshold does slightly more damage. Hollow point does much more damage but is easily blocked by armor. Overcharge used by energy weapons increases damage but degrades the weapon more quickly. Slug used by shotguns. Slugs repair buckshot with a single large bullet that is more accurate. To switch ammo subtypes, equip them on this menu outside of the pit boy press. D-pad. Uh, oh my god. Have to cycle through ammo subtypes for your current bubble. Okay. Uh, Alright. How do I get out of here? I have 18 caps. DT of 0. Weight is 4 out of 190. And hit points 280. Okay. If I go here. Settings. Display. Let's try blue. Yeah, I think I might like that better. Maybe I like that better. We will see. Okay. Um, so I need to go outside and talk to somebody named Sunny. I guess I won't pick up any junk yet until I figure out what I need. Otherwise, I don't know. You guys know me. I always carry a lot of crap. All right, secure trial, blah, 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 okay. Whoa. You discovered good springs. Okay. Maybe I need to turn the brightness down. Yeah, I definitely like the blue. Uh, settings, display. Yeah, maybe that's better. Okay, so... Oh, wait. Sorry, let's go back. Um, where do I review my quests? D data, right? No. Okay. Where are the quests in here, though? Uh, aid... So I can't bash. Okay, so there's no bashing. That puts the gun away. Okay, but how do I like take a look at what quests I have? It's not on this menu, right? That would make no sense, no. Uh, okay, I guess I'll just keep walking, but I do have like an active quest. Uh, uh, guys, I'm playing this on an Xbox. Uh, oh wait, now I'm in a map. Wait, how did I get here? Oh wait, 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 I'm so dumb. 
Oh, okay, sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, that map is useless to me. Good Springs. Nope. Can I... Okay. How big are we looking here? Okay. Where's Las Vegas? Or New Vegas? Is that this area? No, it's this area. This is Vegas. Okay. And we are here. Okay. Hmm. Oh, wait. No, I wanted to look at the quest. Sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. Uh, so this one, I guess I finished. Okay, so anything that's, like, faded, I finished. Okay, back the way they went. Inquire about your delivery assignment with the administrator of the Mojave Express in Prim. Optional, talk to Victor in Goodspring about your rescue. Find the men who tried to kill you. Ooh, that's... I'm not advanced enough for that one. Back in the saddle. Talk to Sunny Smiles in the Prospector Saloon. Maybe let's do that first. And then we'll find Victor. Alright. Maybe I can find different clothing. What are these? Oh, are these pineapples? Do pineapples grow? Yeah, pineapples do grow like that. Hmm. Hello, sir. Hey there. Let me. Hey. Uh, am I pushing the right button? Okay, if you're looking for supplies. Me. Chet over at the general store can help you out. Okay. Oh, so I can't pick his crops. That's considered stealing. I probably have to become a member of a society, right? Can I open? Yeah, let's go inside. Okay. Okay. Right. That's pretty standard. Red is stealing. I don't want to steal just yet. Although I think my character, um, you know, she grew up in this land, so she's already hardened, and she is not above doing whatever she needs to do to survive. Maybe this character will be evil. I don't know. Okay. What is this thing? You like a mutated mountain goat? Or just a mutated goat? Hello, sir. Young bighorner. All right. Okay, let's just find this saloon place. Um, oh, the map is there, or like the compass is there. Okay, so I need to go this way. I'm assuming that like blinking triangle thing. Wait, no. This is where I need to go. The saloon like right here. Yes. Did I just drink the toilet water? Gross. <laughs> oh my god. <coughs> oh, a dog. Hello, sir. Cheyenne, stay. Don't worry. She won't bite okay. unless I tell her to. Ma'am. Uh, Doc Mitchell said you could teach me to survive in the desert. Oh, okay. Let's do this one first. Yeah, Doc Mitchell said you could teach me to survive in the desert. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. Maybe this, like, caps job, or not caps job, but this courier job I'm doing um, flashing arrow on the compass shows your location. Yeah, I figured that out. Thanks. Um, is, okay, I think I want to pick this up, but not right now. I don't want to steal just yet. Um, maybe this, like, courier job was my first one, and I, like, just really fucked up because I didn't know what I was doing. Right, okay. We don't want to do that. Hello, sir. Hey there. Hey. Okay. Um, where am I going? Behind the saloon. Uh, 
I should have just followed her instead of getting distracted. I'm assuming it's outside. Uh, okay, this is the saloon. Yo, can I ride these? Fucking sick. Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? Um. Do you know anything about Victor? The machine? Harmless. No matter what Trudy says. She thinks it's hiding something. But I think it's just a broken down relic with no place to be. Okay. Why are you called Easy Pete? Was a prospector until I decided to settle here to get away from the NCR. Now NCR. I'll just take it easy and help out with the Brahmin and Big Horners. Okay. Um You were prospector. Do you like digging for gold and silver? No, it's funny how I would ask. Yeah, sure. <laughs> no, no. Means I poke through old buildings looking for working tech and such. Some folks mm. just call it salvaging, but never like the term. The way I see it, salvage means it's broken, near worthless. Me, I look for the good stuff. Guns, chems, spare parts. Good money in it. Okay. Did you ever find anything good while prospecting? Nope. Had a pretty good claim once, way out east by the river. But got run off by raiders. Eventually got too old to keep going out. Hmm. What's wrong with the NCR? Don't get me wrong. The NCR's got a lot of decent folk in it. It's just that they make you part of them whether you like it or not. Towns like Good Springs and Prim don't stay independent for long. Not if you've got something the NCR wants. Still, the NCR keeps the Legion away. Right, the Legion are bad, right? The wait, there's two factions, the Legion and what was the other one called? I'll have to rewatch that. Um, okay. Do anything about the people who attacked me. No, wait, yeah, tell me about the Legion. They're slavers. Led right. by a guy named Caesar. Or Kaisar. Not sure how you're supposed Kaiser. to say Kaiser. A couple of years ago they tried to take over Hoover Dam, but the right. NCR beat them back. Oh, okay, the NCR okay, okay. didn't or couldn't finish the job, though. The Legion's got its strength back and is getting ready for another round at the dam. My money's still on the NCR winning, but you never know. Hmm. We've been hearing stories about Legionaries on the Nevada side of the river, so keep a gun handy. You don't want to get caught by them. This is where, like, do I have to choose a faction eventually? What's oh, important about Hoover Dam? The dam powers a lot of New Vegas, and then there's all that clean water lying in Lake Mead, too. Anybody mm. who owns the dam owns the territory. Okay, do you anything about the people who attacked me? The one in the fancy suit seemed to be calling the shots. That's as much mm. as I know. Other folks in town might know more. Word of advice, though, if you ever catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Can't be trusted, I'd say. What do you use big corners for? Meat and hide, mostly. Can't put a pack on them. They just lay down until you take it off. Can find a bunch of wild ones high up in the hills, but gotta be careful around them. They can put up a decent fight if cornered. Okay, good to know. Um, is that everything? All right, goodbye. Keep your gun handy if you go poking around some of the abandoned places around here, like the schoolhouse. Critters move in there sometimes. Okay. Be careful in the schoolhouse. Where is the ghost girl I'm supposed to meet? I guess I could just look on my compass. Like inside? Oh, right here. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take no. this and try to hit a couple of them. Okay. How do I take it? Everything all right? Uh, I want to ask you some questions. Well, let's just finish this first, all right? Then we could talk. Preferably somewhere where I can get a stiff drink and Cheyenne can keep cool. Sounds good. Are you going to give Cheyenne to me? 
Where is this thing? I'm, what am I shooting? Oh. I'm doing it. I'm gonna like do it from farther away. Am I like too far away? Nice shot. Well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Uh, okay. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways. I like what you're wearing. Can I have that instead of this vault suit? I don't want to wear a vault suit in this game. I have no allegiance to a vault. I don't care about vaults. Why does my character care about vaults? It's not her life. I want this outfit. Oh my gosh. Oh, I was sneaking? What? Ah, okay. Wait, what? Okay. Stop stopping! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Is that a chest over there? Hear that up on the ridge okay. behind me there? We got some geckos to clear out. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. Okay, you're on. Go give him hell. So wait, am I crouching? Oh, that one's crouch. Where are these geckos? Wait, RB. Oops. I am crouching. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. Oh, okay, welcome to the Vault Tech Assisted Training System. Our VATS fats displays the chance you will hit along with conditions of each body heart. Blah, 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 blah. Gotcha. I want to see if I can loot its body. Uh. Okay, let's just see everything. Yeah, I'll take uh, everything. Take all. Okay, what about you? Search. I'll just take everything. Oh wait, was I looking at my inventory? Oh, I was looking at my inventory. Okay, sorry, that's confusing. Oh, okay, because I can just transfer things to the gecko radio. Okay, I'll have to, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, 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 I got it. See? You're getting the hang of it. 
There's two more wells that still need clearing. You want, you can come along. It'd be worth a few caps to me. Yeah, I need the money. Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes, especially nice. with two of us. Come with me. Yeah, let's go. I'm assuming these gecko hides are probably useful, right? Hmm. All right, where's my girl, Sunny? Hi, Cheyenne. Where is Sunny? Where is she? Over here. Can I interact with this? Activate. Okay. Where is she? Fuck are you? Holy moly. If you hadn't come here like you done, I'd be a goner for sure. I came up here to draw water, but here, you should have what I got. You look thirsty. Okay, reputation. You have established a reputation with a group of people in the wasteland. Whether the reputation is good or bad, you're finally somebody and people associated with that group will start to react to what you've done. There are many different factions in the wasteland, and you can develop a distinct reputation with each one. As you perform actions that benefit a group, you will gain fame. If you perform actions that harm a group, you will gain infamy. Your reputation with any given group is a measure, measure of the combined total of fame and infamy that you have earned. The benefits and drawbacks of any given reputation depend on the group itself. You may receive discounts with merchants, provoke attacks from pirate thugs, or simply be treated differently. Though you will initially start out with a neutral reputation with any given faction, your fame and infamy will eventually push your reputation in different directions. You can see all of your current reputations under the general section of your pit boy. Good reputations. Smiling troublemaker. Some good, a little bad. Good, natural rascal. Good, a little bad. Accepted. Some good. Liked. Definitely good. Idolized. Most good. Mixed reputations. Soft heart devil. More bad than good. Dark hero. More good than bad. Okay. Mixed, some good, some bad, unpredictable, good and bad, wild child, most good, most bad, okay. Bad reputations, sneering punk, some bad, a little good, merciful thug, bad, a little good, shunned, some bad, hated, definitely bad, vilified, most bad, okay. Good springs accepted, folks have come to accept you for your helpful nature. Alrighty. Where is Sunny though? Oh, there she is. Girl, you ran away from me while I was looting. Good spring source. Hi. Now that was some good work. Even got a little exciting there at the end. Here's a little spending money for the trouble. One more thing I wanted to show you. Thought I might teach you about living off the land and making useful things for yourself. Interested? Yes. All right, then. We'll need a couple ingredients to get started. Gonna want some Xander root and a Brock flower. Let me think now. I know I've seen Brock flowers growing up at the graveyard, and I seem to remember there being Xander root over by the schoolhouse. Okay. Bring those on back to me, and we'll get cooking. Graveyard and schoolhouse. Gotcha. Okay. Uh...
Yo, there's an arm there. Or is that the gecko's arm? Okay, well, I need to go this way. Uh, okay, I guess I should take that. Empty, empty. Okay. Is there a way to run? Uh, I'm gonna have to re tear or like fix the buttons on the controller or something. <laughs> Reconfigure the controller. Okay, yeah, that's gonna be annoying if I keep pushing that and I hide. Okay, anyways, I need to go this way. Um, okay, I guess I'm going here first. Is this the graveyard I'm going to? Wrong button. Sorry. No, I don't want to quit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that looks so stupid. Is there a way I can like see what my character looks like from the front? Where am I going? Is there a way I can run? Maybe I should like move this out of the way here. Okay. Okay. Don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. Okay, that does that. Uh, that does that. Trying to follow, okay, the one north or the one. Let's just go to the one that's in the north first, okay. What does this red thing on the compass mean? Okay, never mind. Never mind. Yeah, that red line. What does that mean? Okay, so the red things are enemies, good to know. Is this the graveyard? Sorry, that's a this button. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Die. Friggin' mosquito. Okay, what am I looking for? Ah. Uh. Oh my god, okay, this gun is shitty. Okay, is this what I'm looking for? Okay, I should probably get a couple more, right? Empty, empty. Are there any more of these plants or was there just one? You not. You found a limited edition Mojave landmark snow globe. These rare pre-war artifacts are widely considered to be useless baubles, but rumor has it some collectors will pay dearly for them. Nice, okay. Is there any more of this plant or is it just the one? Okay, I guess there's just that one. And I need to obtain a shovel so I can dig up that grave. Okay, I guess now we're going to the schoolhouse to get the other thing. Is there any way to run? How do you like... I've pushed all the buttons already. I also need to get a better gun. I hate these shotguns. I guess I could use my laser rifle. I'll upgrade to that in a sec. Is this the schoolhouse here? No, that looks like a schoolhouse. What is this building? Alright, what needs to die over here? A giant mantis nymph. Oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> All right, I'll be using vats a lot in this game, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> uh, let me loot you. Okay. What am I trying to find here? Okay. Bring the Brock flower and Xander root to Sunny at the campfire. Okay. Will it do? Are these like little Joshua trees? <clears throat> so cute. Take that. <clears throat> okay, I have to keep like my eyes out for a shovel. Where is this campfire? Why is the campfire all the way out here?
Okay, I go slightly faster when I'm not holding the gun. Good to know, okay. Okay, that's, that's the same button for the flashlight. That's good to know. Is this the campfire? Will I die? Okay. Um, you know, let's just exit right now. Where is she? Is she over here? Okay. Let me see what you got. Yeah, these will do just fine. <clears throat> just fine. All right, now. We're gonna be making something folks on the trail call healing powder. Go on over to that campfire now. Give it a try. Okay. Right. Okay, uh, so if I hit X, I wanna make, how many can I make? Okay, so Brock Flower and Xander Root. I'm gonna write this down, otherwise I'm gonna forget. Just hold on, give me a second, guys. Okay, Brock Flower and Xander Root equals healing. Okay, now it's written down, it's in my head to find those things. I'll put a sticky note on my computer to look out for Brock Root and Zander Flower. I guess I'll make one. Healing powder added, okay. Perfect. What else can I make? I need prickly pear fruit and I can make a bloat fly slider. What does that do? Effects. Plus one rads, plus four hit points. Can I make anything else? No. Hmm. Okay. Uh, okay, I guess I have to go back to her now. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it won't be a campfire you need. Might need to do some work on your guns and ammo, maybe. Important thing to get is it's all the same idea. You just need to find the right place to set up shop. Workbench or reloading bench, whatever. Well, I hope that's enough to get you started. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. Trudy, she's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd okay. be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. All right, I guess we'll go to the saloon and talk to Trudy. Can I interact with the dog? Cheyenne, you're just like dog meat. You're so cute, look at you. Oh my God, I love you, okay. I guess we'll go. Talk to Trudy. Wait, well the water water heals me, right? Did that do anything? Okay, that's gonna be really tedious. If I need to like okay, that's fine. Um I think I just need to do it this last time. Perfect, okay, I have full health now. That's good. Hello, who are you? Hey. Barton Thorne. Hello, can you help me? Uh, what's wrong? My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge and I can't get to her. Please, she's going to die. Where is she? Go up the path. 
Pass the broken radio tower and go to the right. They're at the top of the trail. Okay. You will? Thank you for helping me. Please hurry. You better give me a reward. I'm not doing this for free. Before you venture deeper into the wasteland, you may revise your character. No, we're fine. Okay, I can't pick that. That totally looks like something I can harvest. This way? Put that away. Wrong thing. I just want to make sure I'm doing the right quest here. Uh, no, no, no. I want to do this one. No, wait. Wait, where's the one to find the guy's girlfriend? That's not a quest? Oh, wait, is it miscellaneous? Deliver the package at the north entrance to Vegas Strip by way of free side an agent of the recipient will meet you at the checkpoint take possession of the package and pay for the delivery bring the payment to johnson nash at the mojave express agency and param bonus on completion 250 caps manifest this package contains one oversized poker chip composed of platinum contract penalties you are an authorized agent of the mojave express package until the delivery is complete and payment has been processed contractually obligated to complete this transaction and materially responsible for any amount of malice or loss. Okay, failure to deliver the proper recipient may result in forfeiture of your advance and bonus. Criminal charges under pursuit by mercenary reclamation teams. The Mojave Express is not responsible for any injury or loss of life you experience as a result of said reclamation efforts. Jesus. Um, I... I kind of want to help this guy's girlfriend first. Like, he's just going to stand there and let her die? Okay, is this the... He said radio tower? Oh, wait. I have... Is it the one that's... Which one is it? This is so confusing. I'm assuming... Okay, I go up, and then he said to the right? Can we go over here? Oh my god, there's so many! <laughs> Dude, uh, they are destroying me. Ah, I'm true. Oh my god. Oh fuck, oh fuck. I'm oh god, oh god, oh god. First we're gonna do that one. And then we're gonna friggin...
Did that heal me enough? Okay, we'll just... Wait, that didn't heal me? What? What? But I fucking... Use? How do you use? I pressed A. Use. 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 What? I'm out of bullets? Uh, fuck! Uh. And I'm just like using this shitty fucking rifle and I can't even bash? Oh my god. Fucking bat! Oh my god. <laughs> Am I back at the beginning? <gasps> Are you fucking kidding me? I have to do all that over again? No fucking way. Are you serious? What? Okay, guys, I'm going to do it again off camera then. <laughs> or do you want to watch me do this again? Are you fucking kidding me? I don't even have my hat. No, I like the hat I got. Oh, that's my bad for not saving. But there's no quick save option. There's only a hard save option. Like it's either hard save, one out of zero out of, can I, s like there's no, what? <sighs> okay guys, I don't know. Um, okay. <laughs> Here's what I'm gonna do guys. I'm gonna end the game here for today. Let me know in the comments. Do you want to rewatch me do all of this again? Or would you prefer if I just did it all off camera and then we kind of like picked up, we'll say where, okay, I'm not going to do that gecko thing again because fuck that, but pretty much after the food tutorial is pretty, is where I would like start up again. Let me know. Do you want to rewatch all of this again? Or do you want me to just like play off camera until I finish that food tutorial with Sunny? Let me know. Anyways. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Sorry about dying. And um, yeah, let me know what you think. And uh, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.